Welcome to this 10-day journey towards ultimate success through the power of hypnotherapy. Over the next 10 days, we will delve into various aspects of your life. Goal setting, breaking mental barriers, building self-confidence, and so much more to pave the path to your success. Thank you for trusting this process. It's an honor to be part of your journey. As we embark on this transformative journey, it's important to start at the very foundation, goal setting. You see, goals are more than mere destinations or achievements we hope to reach. They serve as our compass, our guide through the labyrinth of life's decisions and distractions. Knowing what you're striving for can make all the difference between a life lived by default and one lived by design. And if you stay to the end of this session, I'll tell you something about goals and goal setting that you won't hear anywhere else, which will transform your life and the way you approach goal setting in the future. In the psychological realm, goals serve as an essential motivator, providing a concrete vision that directs our behaviors and choices. Without them, it's like setting sail without a map. You may be moving, but are you really getting anywhere? Goals give you a sense of direction and meaning. Moreover, the process of setting goals is also crucial. It's not just about saying, I want to be successful, or I want to be wealthy. Such generalities are hard to measure and even harder to reach. This is where the smart goal setting framework comes into play. Specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time bound is a systematic way to set objectives that are clear, attainable, and aligned with your bigger vision. You'll often hear people say, set big goals, the kind that scare you a bit. While there's merit in stretching beyond your comfort zone, it's equally important for the goals to be achievable. There's a sweet spot between setting a goal that's too easy and setting one that's so far out of reach that it's discouraging. An achievable goal is one that stretches you, but doesn't break you. It's not just the end result, but also the journey to it that counts. Goals allow us to track our progress, and every milestone reached is a small victory that fuels our motivation. Achieving smaller goals en route to a larger one creates a snowball effect of positive reinforcement. And if you encounter setbacks, as we all do, your goals can serve as a beacon, reminding you to recalibrate and continue forward. Now relevance is another aspect to consider. Your goals need to align with your life's mission, your values, and your bigger aspirations. Goals that lack relevance can be demotivating because they do not serve a higher purpose in your life. Lastly, setting a time frame around your goal serves two primary purposes. It creates urgency and helps in planning. While long-term goals shape our vision for the future, short-term goals serve as stepping stones to get us there. Today, we'll tap into the untapped regions of your mind to set such smart goals using hypnotherapy as our vehicle. So buckle up, it's going to be an enlightening ride. Please ensure that you're in a safe and comfortable environment before continuing with this session. Please do not listen to this session while driving or operating heavy machinery. You know, as you sit there comfortably listening, you might already start to realize how much of a transformative experience this journey will be. Just as a seed deep within the soil, already contains the essence of a magic tree, so too does your mind contain the essence of your future success. Take a moment to feel the seat beneath you, grounding you like the earth grounds that seed. Perhaps you could start to let your eyes close if they haven't already. And that's it, just like that. You can let go as easily as leaves falling from a tree in autumn. 
feel the weight of your eyelids as you listen to my voice, guiding you towards a state of relaxation and openness. You might start to notice the rhythm of your breath naturally slowing down as if it knows, knows how to pave the way for a calmer you. In this state, you don't need to do anything. There's nowhere to go and nothing to achieve right this moment. Isn't it fascinating how your mind already knows how to create this safe space for you? Even if it's for a brief period, you're free from the limitations of time. And you might be wondering just how deep you'll go into this trance. And the deeper you wander, the deeper you go. That's right, like a stone gently sinking into a serene pond. You find yourself more deeply relaxed than ever before. Even your thoughts might slow down, giving you the space to just be. You see, you can allow yourself this time Time to become open to new possibilities. Time to lay down the foundation for the life you desire. A life by design, not by default. You know some people find it easy to explore the caverns of their mind. March like an adventurer might wander through an ancient forest captivated by its depth and mystery. And as you allow yourself to wander deeper into your inner sanctuary, you might become aware of a staircase. One that spirals down into a deeper level of your unconscious. Each step you take could lead you into a more profound state of tranquility. Take the first step down and maybe you'll feel a sensation, perhaps a tingling, maybe a warmth. And isn't it curious how your body knows exactly how to relax more deeply as you move further down? And as you take another step, you could find that your senses are becoming more acute, more focused. Imagine you're hearing a symphony of your thoughts, each note playing in perfect harmony with your state of deep relaxation. Continue to descend the staircase. With each step, you might feel as though you're shedding a layer, peeling away concerns or doubts that you don't need right now. And isn't it fascinating how the deeper you go, the lighter you feel, like a leaf caught in a gentle breeze, floating effortlessly. You may have reached the bottom of the staircase now, or maybe you're still drifting downwards. Either way is perfect. This space you've arrived in is yours, a tranquil sanctuary where your mind and soul can breathe freely. Take a moment here to soak in this tranquility, knowing that you can return to this sanctuary whenever you wish. Feeling deeply relaxed now, deeply in tune with your inner world, you're prepared to explore goal setting more thoroughly. 
And as you continue to dwell in this realm of possibility, you might realize that your unconscious mind has a fascinating way of connecting dots, creating patterns, and setting paths that you consciously might not even be aware of. Sometimes it feels like a mystery, but a mystery doesn't always need solving, does it? Sometimes the beauty of it lies in the journey. Let's take a moment, a moment for you to truly imagine your ultimate success. As you're sitting there, deeply relaxed, I wonder if you can imagine what success is for you. And while you're considering this, your unconscious mind has a wonderful ability to start taking steps towards that vision all by itself. And isn't it intriguing how the mind knows how to bridge gaps between where you are and where you want to be. And as you keep this vision of success vivid in your mind, think about what you hear, what you see and what you feel. And now imagine yourself putting this vision into a beautiful frame hanging it on the wall of possibilities. Whenever you look at this frame, remember it's not just a picture, it's a window into your future. You have the ability to step into this frame whenever you choose, and each time you do you'll notice something new, something you didn't see before. Now think about goals you've already achieved in the past, and recognize that in each of these successes were elements of planning, of setting intentions, and turning those intentions into reality. In a way, your mind already has the skills, the tools, to achieve what you imagine, It's as if your mind has been in training for this moment, whether you knew it or not. And now, you can use that training to truly set a smart goal. Allow yourself to ponder what is one specific goal that aligns with this vision of ultimate success. Let your unconscious mind bring this goal into focus, make it specific, as specific as your favorite song or your favorite movie. And while you're contemplating this, ask yourself how you'll measure success, how will you know you've achieved it. Your unconscious mind knows the metrics, even if you haven't considered them consciously yet. Now think about the achievable aspect. Is this goal truly achievable with the skills and resources you currently possess? Or will you need to acquire something more? No answer is wrong. It simply helps you plan. And how relevant is this goal to your ultimate success? A relevant goal is like a stepping stone, leading you across the river of uncertainty into the land of achievement. And finally, let's set a time frame. Time, after all, has a way of bringing urgency, of crystallizing our intentions into action. Imagine a calendar in your mind and see yourself marking a date, a date when this goal will be realized. 
and realize that time is but a construct, yet a useful one in setting our paths straight. And isn't it fascinating how sometimes, when a goal is set, when the path is paved, something magical begins to happen. It's as if the universe conspires to bring resources, opportunities and people into your life to help you achieve that goal. It's as though setting a smart goal sends ripples through the pond of your life and the echoes return as opportunities. It's not enough just to set a goal, is it? You probably already recognize the value of embedding this goal deep in your unconscious mind. It's like planting a seed in fertile soil, watering it and let it bask in the sun and the more you water this seed with your attention, the more robustly it will grow. You might find it helpful to consider how this goal integrates into your daily routine. Imagine waking up in the morning with this goal already on your mind. And as you go about your day, how can you take small steps to make it a reality? Each small action is like a drop of water nourishing the seed, encouraging it to sprout and flourish. And you know it's entirely possible. The challenges might appear along the way. What's important is not the absence of challenges, but how you perceive them. Consider them as lessons or perhaps as signposts, directing you towards a more effective path. In every challenge, there's an opportunity to learn and grow. So when you encounter a hurdle, you might just find it exciting because your subconscious will know it's a chance to stretch to evolve. You might even become aware of the power of regular reflection on your goal. Regular check-ins with yourself can act like a compass, ensuring you're still heading in the direction you desire. And each time you do check in, perhaps you could allow yourself to feel a sense of accomplishment in the progress you've made. Even if it's a small step, it's still a step closer to your framed vision of ultimate success. And by now, you've probably realized how embedded this goal has become in your subconscious mind. It's become a part of your internal framework, a guiding force in your actions and decisions. Even when you're not consciously thinking about it, your unconscious mind is working, problem-solving, and seeking opportunities to bring you closer to it. And as we're coming to the end of this deep state of internal focus, realize that you're not leaving this goal behind. No, you're carrying it with you, embedded deep within your psyche, continually nourished by your actions and intentions. And just like that framed picture on your wall of possibilities, it's always there, always in sight, even when you're not looking directly at it. And as you feel yourself beginning to return to the room, to the here and now. Imagine each inhalation drawing you closer to the surface of awareness, like a diver ascending from the depths. Each breath you take is a step upwards, back to the bright and vivid world above. Notice how the world around you starts to come back into focus, yet something significant has changed, 
Something has shifted deep within you. Something you might not even fully comprehend just yet. But it's there, radiating its transformative power through every fibre of your being. You might find it fascinating how over the next few days, weeks or even months, you'll discover yourself naturally drawn to situations and choices that align with your ultimate success. It's as if a light has been switched on, illuminating your path, allowing you to navigate your journey with a newfound sense of purpose and clarity. And so, with each ascending breath, let a feeling of anticipation build within you, a feeling of exhilaration for the journey ahead, for the new possibilities now stretched out before you. It's as if your subconscious mind has awakened from a deep slumber, fully recharged and keenly focused on steering you towards the realization of your dreams. And as your awareness continues to rise, consider this, your ultimate goal, the vision of your most profound success is now deeply ingrained within the fabric of your subconscious mind, continually influencing your thoughts, your actions and your choices. And when you're ready, when it feels right, you can allow your fingers to start moving, maybe give your toes a little wiggle, perhaps stretch your arms and legs and feel the invigorating energy coursing through you. Feel yourself fully recharged, renewed and resolutely focused on your path towards ultimate success. And as you continue with your daily life, each decision, each action, even each thought will be subtly influenced by your ultimate vision of success. Your subconscious mind, acting like a loyal and astute guide, will naturally steer you towards choices that align with your defined goals. You might be pleasantly surprised to find how easy and natural it becomes to move closer to your dreams. Now that you have taken the first major step towards your ultimate success by setting a well-defined goal, the real work begins. Your homework for today serves as a foundational practice that will shape the rest of this transformative journey. But before we begin, let me follow up on that promise I made at the beginning of this session. You know how everyone says you should write down your goals. Well, it turns out that's only half of the story. For some people, writing down a goal actually tricks the brain into thinking it's already achieved the goal. So instead of helping you, it might actually be setting you back. This isn't some new idea either. People have been talking about a study from Harvard that supposedly proved writing down your goals makes you more successful. But guess what? That study never happened. It's a myth. So if you've tried writing down your goals and haven't got far, don't beat yourself up. From now on, do what works for you. If writing helps, go for it. If not, just keep your goals in your head. Either way is fine. Oh, and one last thing. Don't share your goals. People who share their goals are far less likely to complete them. Once again, if you're telling someone what your goal is, then you've already done it, haven't you? Okay, on to the homework. First, find a quiet spot where you won't be disturbed for about 10 minutes. If you're writing this down, grab a journal and a pen. If not, just get comfy and focus. Open your journal, or your mind, and title it my ultimate success. Then get detailed about your goal. Make it smart, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. It doesn't matter if you're writing it down or just thinking it through. Make it as clear as possible. Once your goal is set, take a minute to feel it. How does it make you feel? Excited? Nervous? Write these feelings down or just note them in your mind. Trust me, it will help you to know how your goal makes you feel. Now let's dig a little deeper. Why is this goal so important to you? What changes will it bring into your life? Knowing your why is like having fuel in your car. It'll keep you moving forward. Next up, your action box. This could be on paper or in your head. Just think of the very first thing you can do to get closer to your goal. Got it? 
Promise yourself you'll do that thing within the next 24 hours. And finally, leave some space or mental room for reflections. Once you've taken that first step, come back and think how it went. Did you learn something? Do you find it tough or easy? Reflecting like this gives you super useful tips for what to do next. Remember, this exercise has power. Whether you're writing it down or just visualizing it in your mind, it helps you make your goal feel real, pushes you to act and helps you to get clear on what you're doing. So dive in and make it a cornerstone of your journey to ultimate success. Congratulations on completing day one of this transformative journey. You've set the cornerstone for your ultimate success and that's no small feat. Next time, we'll dive into the intriguing world of breaking mental barriers. We will confront those limiting beliefs that may have held you back in the past. Get ready to unleash your full potential. Until next time, goodbye and good mental health.